Hello, how to solve for x in this equation, square root of x and square root of x and square root of x and square root of x is equal to 5. We're going to make use of two methods. Let's consider the first method, solution. We have method 1. Then take note of this that if you have square root of a, this is equal to a to the power of 1 over 2. Then here we have square root of x, the first term can be written as square root of s multiplied by, then here the second one is square root of this square root of x, we have square root of square root of x multiplied by this third x is square root of square root of square root of x square root of square root and square root of s multiplied by then this fourth x is square root and square root and square root and square root of x we have square root square root square root and square root of s is equal to 5 now since if you have square root of a is equal to a to the power of 1 over 2 then let's transform this into this form that is, we have x to the power of 1 over 2 multiplied by, this is s to the power of 1 over 2 to the power of 1 over 2. Then multiply by, this is s to the power of 1 over 2, then bracket to the power of 1 over 2, then bracket bracket to the power of 1 over 2 and the last one here multiply by we have s to the power of 1 over 2 bracket to the 1 over 2 bracket to the power of 1 over 2 and also bracket to the power of 1 over 2 then is equal to 5 now let's see this is take note of this that if you have a to the power of m to the power of n is equal to a to the power of n to the power of m this is equal to a to the power of m n then this can be written as s to the power of 1 over 2 multiplied by s to the power of 1 over 2 times 2 that is 4 multiplied by s to the power of 1 over 2 times 2 4 times 2 that is 8 multiplied by s to the power of 1 over 2 times 2 4 4 times 2 8 8 times 2 that is 16 is equal to 5 now here s is common we have s to the power of here the SEM is 16 then 2 in 16 that is 8 8 times 1 we have 8 plus 4 in 16 4 that's 1 that is 4 plus 8 in 16 2 times 1 that is 2 plus 16 16 1 times 1 that is 1 is equal to 5 then this is s to the power of 8 plus 2 10 plus 4 14 plus 1 15 then we have 15 divided by 16 is equal to 5 but we are looking for the value of s let's multiply the exponent of both sides of this equation by 16 divided by 15 that is we have s to the power of 
15 divided by 16 to the power of 16 divided by 15 is equal to 5 to the power of 16 divided by 15. Then this will cancel this and this will cancel this. Therefore, S is equal to 5 to the power of 16 over 15. And this is the final answer. Now, let's consider the second method called method 2. Method 2. Then from the given equation, we have square root of s square root of s and then square root of s and square root of s is equal to 5. Now let's square both sides of this equation. We have square root of s and square root of s and square root of x and square root of x all square is equal to 5 square. So this we cancel this we have x square root of x and square root of x and square root of x is equal to 25. Now let's square both sides of this equation again. If you square both sides of this equation, we have a square multiplied by square root of x and square root of s and square root of s square is equal to 25 square. So this, we cancel this again, we have s square multiplied by s square root of s and square root of s is equal to 25 square. And this is to the power of 1, then we have s to the power of 3 multiplied by square root of s and square root of s is equal to square root of 25 square. This is 625. Let's square both sides of this equation again. We have s to the power of 3 multiplied by square root of s square root of s square is equal to 625 square and this is s to the power of 3 to the power of 2 multiplied by square root of s square root of s square is equal to 625 square. Then for me we have s to the power of 6 multiplied by s square root of s is equal to 625 square. Then this is s to the power of 7 multiplied by square root of s is equal to 625 square. Now let's square both sides of this equation again. Square and this square. We have s to the power of 7 square multiplied by this, we cancel this. s is equal to this is. 625 to the power of 4. Now this is s to the power of 7 times 2 we have 14 multiplied by s is equal to this is 
5 to the power of 4 to the power of 4. Then this is s to the power of this is also to the power of 1. We have 15. It's equal to 5 to the power of 4 times 4. That is 16. Now let's divide the exponent of both sides by 1 over 15. That is s to the power of 15 to the power of 1 over 16, 1 over 15 is equal to 5 to the power of 16 to the power of 1 over 15. This will cancel this. Then s is equal to 5 to the power of 16 over 15. And this is the final answer. I hope you enjoyed the video. Thank you for watching. Please don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe to my channel. Bye.